have a trans daughter. Jamie Lee Curtis is scared, and you should be too. Hey everyone, I'm in the United States with Misha Petrov. I have found some pretty wild TikToks for you to react to today. Mm -hmm. Hell yes, I am. So, you know. Oh, look at this shirt. <laughs> what is that? Like a nunchuck? I'm not sure. Yeah, I think it's like a, it's a weapon. It is a weapon. Mm hmm. So what do you think about that message? I think that's so respectful, you know? Like they're always talking, we want respect, respect us. I think this is very nice. This is a very respectful way to get your point across by threatening people. Right. <laughs> so that's what I think, yeah. This looks like a happy individual too, I would say. I think it's a woman, well, yeah, I'd say it's a woman that would probably tell you that she's a man. Right. But that's my opinion, I don't know. I, don't <laughs> I know think so that. too. Yeah. This is the same person. Oh. I'm sorry, this has to be addressed. How, how did this become this, become this, become this? No, so, not yes. Jamie Lee Curtis. She's a very famous actress. Yeah. And she bought one of these shirts. And this is, I think this shirt is even worse than the other one because there's an, a knife on it. Oh, straight up. Just right. Straight up a knife. Yeah. It's really do this or else uh -huh. in the name of tolerance. Uh -huh. Does that make sense? It does not make sense. And these people hate like guns too, but I've seen one where they have a gun on their shirt. Right. So it's only okay when you're trying to threaten other people, right? <laughs> to protect trans kids. But to protect yourself, you are not allowed to uh -huh. carry weapons. Uh -huh. Yeah, apparently you need a knife to protect trans kids. But yeah, it's very wild mm -hmm. that she would pose. That's crazy to me. That's actually very crazy. She has a a trans kid. Kid. Trans daughter. Meaning her son. Do we have a video of the daughter son? We have a picture. We have a picture? It's funny because I saw this picture after I heard another video you're gonna see. Mm -hmm. I'm like, I don't believe it. I don't believe that her <laughs> kid is like trans. Or something? Oh, it's no, just, the I, trans. just the, the story. Yeah. And then I saw this picture. See, to me, that looks Photoshop. Like, that's so funny to me. I have a trans daughter. There are threats against her life. Just her existence as a human being. What do you think about that? What is she talking about? I just want to know. Like, can she, you know, elaborate a little bit? Right. Give us an example. And I love how she's, I have a trans daughter. There's nothing else that has to be said. I'm already better. Right. My trans daughter is already better. That's all you need to know. And no I'm more a than trans you. daughter. Period. <laughs> like, that's not a point. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I think anyone who's in the public eye gets death threats. Yeah. I have received one. Oh, many. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Uh, threats or people wishing I'm not alive, mm -hmm. but it happens. That's just what it is. Like, I, when it's you, not good. It's, it's not, not good. Great. No one's saying that's good or moral, but like you just know that's what's going to happen if you're a public figure, especially if you're so well known as Jamie Lee Curtis or right. her daughter, her son, whatever. So yeah, that, I don't yeah. think that's specific to her being trans. No. It might be, and if it is, of course, not. that's, that's not right, but you have to give us an example of like, what's going on. Right. right. There are people that want to annihilate her and people like her. The level of hatred, as if we haven't learned from fascism, like we haven't learned what what the result of that is. So she's against fas fascism, uh -huh. but she bought that shirt. Yeah, interesting. Not hypocritical at all. No. Yes, there are people who are against trans people, mm -hmm. but when we do this to kids, mm -hmm. and the whole thing with pride and stuff yeah. being so inappropriate, when we do this to kids, you will only create more anti-trans rhetoric and more people will be anti-trans. Mm -hmm. Do we know when she transitioned or no? Yeah. No. No idea. Mm -hmm. You in Hollywood, with all your super lefty friends, really? They're threatening to annihilate her? I just seriously doubt it. I'm just more worried about what trans ideology is doing to kids mm -hmm. and young people mm -hmm. rather than caring so much about what she's yeah. saying. You know what I mean? No, yeah. Like, if you're trans, you're an adult, mm -hmm. you have a lot of rights, you can do whatever you want. Mm -hmm. But when we transition kids, they cannot yeah. consent. Trans people are not victims. Mm -hmm. Adult trans people are not the victims here, mm -hmm. the children are. Truly. So it's it's very narcissistic to care so much about that, yeah. in my opinion. And the solution is not to wear a shirt that's inciting violence and mm -hmm. threatening people. I, when is that the solution? When has that been the solution? Have, haven't we learned from... <laughs> haven't we learned from fascism? The extermination of human beings. That is terrible.
terrifying. So, Jamie Lee Curtis is scared, and uh, you should be too. And Jamie Lee Curtis has a voice, and she's trying to use it, and you should too. And that's how we change things, is we think about them, we learn about them, and then we use our voices to bring attention to them and to fight against them. Why is it terrifying? Yeah, I don't know what she's talking about. Where's the extermination <laughs> happening? Where does it happen? We have the affirming care, right, for kids. We have, I don't know, gender neutral bathrooms. Like, can she please give an example of this extermination? Mm. Please. I don't know. What, what is she talking about? But it is terrifying if you believe in it. It is. It is, of course, for her. I don't know if she's just virtue signaling, though. She's trying to get sympathy, but. Right. I don't know. But I, she's I mean, actually going through the world seeing all these trans flags and pride flags and saying, oh my god, extermination. Mm, right. No, but it must be very terrifying if you believe in stuff yeah, like that. Yeah, of course. I if hope. you walk around with the victim mindset, it sucks. Right. Yeah, there's no doubt. The good news is mm -hmm. just stop believing in it because mm -hmm. it's not happening. Mm -hmm. Look around. Then you'll feel better. Look around. Yeah. Being misgendered, if you go by Zizem Zur, is not transgenocide. No. Nor is it extermination, annihilation. Get it together. Right. Jamie Lee Curtis. Well, if Jamie Lee Curtis is scared, well, then we all must be scared. We all must listen because it is the Jamie Lee Curtis. Right. It was a, what do you call it, a monologue? Yeah. Yeah, that's how, that's the vibe I got. <laughs> it's like she was acting. Yeah, you're right. Those it's little pauses too, those little pauses. Jamie Lee Curtis is scared. Like, oh, okay. Oh, so this is her meeting a fan, I guess. And mm -hmm. I just, the level of cringe, I, I can't handle it. <laughs>《Black Lives Matter》thing. Yeah, but like, oh, maybe that's trans? black trans woman. Oh, black trans woman matter. Yeah, yeah. So that black trans woman that went to hug Jamie Lee Curtis, obviously, that's why it really like resonated with that person, right? I, I felt that, that hug. I it felt said that hug. Oh, it's it's so gross. Like, why? Why do you need that big hug? Yeah. Like, oh, come She's here. like, no, yeah. Look at me. I have this shirt on. Me, the Jamie Lee Curtis, <laughs> right. with this shirt supporting you. But yeah, I, I think the reason why a lot of Hollywood um, stars are trans activists too is because it's a way for them to feel better about themselves. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, right? they'll get applauded for it too. They just want whatever's in to be a part of it. The last thing I want to show you is a shirt mm -hmm. that you can buy, apparently. And it says, I cannot wait for the arguments this shirt will spark from insecure cis people. <laughs> and it says, respect my pronouns or I will... You. Again, very respectful, right? They, they're all about respect. They What's funny is that you're not saying what type of pronouns you want us to use. Right. No, so. we need to know, honestly, because it's we don't want to get stabbed. No, So I think today. You, should, you should clarify that on the show, right? right? <laughs> Otherwise, that's a concern. That's because a we can't concern. assume that you're a trans woman, right. a non-passing trans woman, right? I would have no idea for a, a lot of these people. Yes. So, <laughs> you know what I mean? I would need clarification, like tattoo your pronouns on your... On your forehead, That's perhaps. real commitment. Yeah, yeah. I don't want to see this. The last thing I see before I die, I don't want it to be that, personally. There are people working mm -hmm. at those, like, what, uh, shops. Right. Right? And they just print that. Like, yeah, this is fine. We'll just sell this to people. But thank you for being in my video. Well, thank you so much for having me. And where can people find you? Uh, YouTube, Misha Petrov, and Instagram, Real Misha Petrov. So, yeah. And maybe Twitter? Maybe. Coming soon. Yeah. Probably just being Misha Petrov. She has to. Yeah. I'll do it. I'll do it. <laughs> okay. Great. Thank you. Great. Thank you. Yeah, bye, bye, guys.